Porsche yeah, So beware if you reach, you get scorched Ever since I jumped off the porch I knew that I would grow to be Yo, what's up everyone? This is Blue Nova and I'm here to bring you a tutorial on how to get Black's vocal effects on the song Nonchalant So this tutorial is going to be pretty quick I'm going to run through um, a lot of what I have on the vocal effects chains because there's really a lot of effects. So the first thing I'm going to do is turn off all the effects we have here on the master channel. And on the lead vocal, we're going to start with auto-tune. There's a little bit of auto-tune on, vo on his vocals in this song, sorry. And um, we're just going to start with that first. <clears throat> so what you want to have is have the scale on minor, the key, have that on B. The retune speed, you want to have that at about 10. And this is what it's going to sound like. And also, let me just... Just to show you that uh, this vocal is routed to another insert. And I just did that because altogether when these harmonies are stacked together, I wanted them to just be leveled at negative six. So we're gonna right click, just have that lead vocal and we're gonna play it. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off My nonchalant flow will never end right It be at they necks if it's in sight Squeezing until the crack of windpipe Now that we have that, we're gonna move on to the next thing And uh, I put picture on here, which is gonna be a backup for you guys If you don't have Interis Auto-Tune So it's basically really gonna be the same exact thing um, And have the retune speed equivalent to Interis Auto-Tune So aside from that, we're gonna go to the Fruity Limiter and what we're going to do for this is just activate the compressor. So once you load this in, click on compress. You want to have the release at about 87.67. The attack, I turned it all the way down. Uh, the head, you want to have that at 1.05 milliseconds. Your ratio, turn it all the way to the right. The same with your knee, turn it all the way to the right. And we're just going to bring the threshold down until it's at, you know, the peaks of each, um, each excessive vocal point. So I'm going to play it so you understand what I'm talking about. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off. My nonchalant flow will never end right. It be at they necks if it's in sight. Squeezing until the crack of windpipe. So now we have that, we're gonna move on to the next thing, was gonna be the parametric EQ2. And this is the EQing I did on here in Black's vocals. His vocals are kinda thick um, in this song, and then they do have a good amount of high end in it, but not too much. So what I went ahead and did is got um, got the band, the first band, and I brought it into 59 hertz. Uh, the second one did some cutting at 118 hertz, and the same with all these other ones. Just went in and found the um, the peaks and the vocals that sound a little bit too nasally that I want to kill out. And like I said, in the high end band, you want to boost that in the 10k area. Now this was gonna sound like. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off. My nonchalant flow will never end right. It be at they necks if it's in sight. Squeezing until the crack of windpipe. Now that we have that, the next thing we're gonna add on to the face chain is gonna be a fruity limiter. Now, what you really wanna do is just bring the release down to zero. You wanna bring the gain up to where it's at negative three right here. And we're gonna play, the vocals are gonna be, you know, it's gonna increase in volume at this point. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off. My nonchalant flow will never end right. It be at they necks if it's in sight. Squeezing until the crack of windpipe. After that, we're gonna have a de uh by Waves. And what you're gonna do is just have the frequency set to 5,506. The side chain, you want to select band pass right here and then bring that down to negative 28.8. Now this was going to sound like with the DS vocals. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off. My nonchalant flow will never end right. It be at they necks if it's in sight. Squeezing until the crack of windpipe. So that's with the, with the vocals DS. Now, if you don't have Waves DS here, I added a backup on here, which is gonna be Spitfish, which is a free VST you can find anywhere online. So just to show you, it's gonna have the same exact results. I'm gonna play it. I'm somewhere between humble and hell no. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off. My nonchalant flow will never end right. It be at they necks if it's in sight. Squeezing until the crack of windpipe. Loosen the grip, have a little remorse. 
So these are the settings that I had for it. Um, so I really just suggested it to where a lot of those uh, hard S's were just cut out and just, you know, really just smooth, smoothed out throughout the whole vocals. So after we have that, we're gonna have a H delay stereo. And um, really just comparing it back to Black's vocals, I noticed that it did have um, a filtered or radio sounding kind of uh, delay. So these are the settings that I did in order to do that. And also there was some uh, left and right panning within his vocal delay. So in order to do that, you wanna make sure you click right here on the left and on the right. That's gonna activate the uh, delay to bounce left and right in the vocals. And with the, um, right here, I just selected host. And uh, these really, these are the settings. You can freeze the screen and copy it, or like I said, you can get on bluenovabeast.com. The raw vocals are included, so you do have my vocals to work with, and every vocal effect chain and master channel on here, so that's gonna be added bonus. And just make sure to freeze the screen, get these settings. Now I'm gonna play what it sounds like. I'm somewhere between humble and hell now. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off My nonchalant flow will never end right It be at they next if it's in sight Squeezing until a crack of windpipe Loosen the grip So now we have that, the last thing is going to be Fruity Reverb And like I provided for everyone, you know, if you don't have H Delay, have Fruity Delay too And these will be the settings for it uh, It's pretty much will get you almost the same thing, not exactly, but it will fill in the beat and the spacing uh, inside. So you do want to get this too. So after we have the delay, we're going to have Fruity Reverb 2. And these are the settings I had. Like I said, I'm going to try to cut in some time, not going through all these numbers, but I'm going to play it so you hear exactly uh, the amount of reverb that's within the vocals. I'm somewhere between humble and hell now. These niggas dropped their second nap on them fell off My nonchalant flow will never end right It be at they next if it's in sight Squeezing until a crack of windpipe Loosen the grip, have a little remorse So yeah, there's a good amount of reverb in here Not too much, but just enough to fill in the space of the beat Now we're gonna move on to the next thing Which is, good, which is really the, the cool effect that everybody wants in here um, So there's a part in here where his vocals are pitched um, which is really just forming pitching. So in order to do that, we're gonna move the vocal right here. We're gonna right click and solo it. Now what you wanna do, instead of having an uh, Interis Auto-Tune, you're going to need Pitcher or some forming pitching VST. But for this purpose, like I said, it's gonna be perfect to use this. So we're gonna turn off all these. Well, not really, we don't even have to turn these. This is basically a replica of the first one. So you wanna save that, then add it to this channel. Um, and we're gonna go with the picture. We're gonna go with picture and click on format. So once you select format on here, I just make sure the key is on B and then minor. And this is what it's gonna do and sound like. Ever since I jumped off the porch, I knew that I would grow to be the boy. Boy, then grow to be the man. Learn how to kill a hug, Peter Pan. And without it, this is what it would sound like. Ever since I jumped off the porch. I knew that I would grow to be the boy Boy then grow to be the man So really with the Foreman pitching in FL Studio uh, There are There will be a little bit of clipping and you know nasty sounds in it um, But you know if you do have waves You can use the Foreman pitching in there But I want to make it easy for everybody to use and understand And this high pitch vocal is really in the background So it doesn't need to be um, too much up front within the mix so that's exactly what I did and then cut out some high end so that the high end frequency doesn't clash with the lead vocal. Now, aside from that, we're also going to have right here, which is gonna be highlight vocal, which is just really an extra harmony that uh, Black did in his song. So this was gonna sound like. Ever since I jumped off the porch, I knew that I would grow to be the boy. The boy then grew to be the man. Learn how to kill a hook, Peter Pan. And make sure when you have this highlight, highlighted vocal, you want to turn this knob all the way to the left. That's going to be the stereo separation. And it's just going to add more stereo and width within the vocal. So now we have all that. We're going to play it together. And we'll start from the lead vocal right here going into this stacked vocal harmony set. Where if you reach, you get scorched. Ever since I jumped off the porch, I knew that I would grow to be the boy. The boy then grow to be the man. And I will play it now with the instrumental. Where if 
you reach, you get scorched Ever since I jumped off the porch I knew that I would grow to be the boy The boy then grow to be the man Learn how to kill a hook, pit a pen so you can see all the vocals are leveled at negative six. That's why I routed it, uh, routed all these vocals to this insert right here so that all of them don't go past that negative six mark. <clears throat> now that we have that, we're gonna go to the master channel, which is gonna be the last thing. So you wanna load in Isotope Ozone 5 equalizer. And like I do in all my tutorials, what it's gonna do is just clean up the high end frequency. So you wanna go to the eighth band, click the drop down, low pass, and then brick wall. And once you select that, just uh, bring in the band to 14,979 hertz, and that's going to clean it up. If you don't have that, I have a master EQ on here, which is going to be a backup. Um, and you, like I said, it will be on BlueNovaBeezy.com, so you can get it from there. The last thing will be a Fruity Soft Clipper, and that's going to make sure the entire mix doesn't go past zero decibels. Now that we have that, I'm going to play everything all together, just to show you the final result. I ain't wanna share, so beware if you reach, you get scorched Ever since I jumped off the porch I knew that I would grow to be the boy The boy then grew to be the man Learn how to kill a hook, Peter Pan I'm trying to make the end stand out And with the uh, master EQ that I have on here, which is gonna be stock plugin I'm gonna play it again, so that it shows, you know, that's gonna have the same exact effect I ain't wanna share, so beware if you reach, you get scorched Ever since I jumped off the porch I knew that I would grow to be the boy The boy then grew to be the man Learn how to kill a hook, Peter Pan I'm trying to make the end stand out So that pretty much wraps up this tutorial on how to get Black's vocals effects in nonchalant um, Make sure to get this is something you really want to use and have uh, just in case you want to apply it to your own songs So get that on bluenovabeats.com uh, With any other vocal preset on there There are different genres, different artists and styles that you can use and apply to your own work If you need your songs mixed and mastered You can go to the contact form on the bottom and send me a message through there Or email me at bluenovabeats at gmail.com Make sure to subscribe, like, share, and comment what you want to see next but thank you all for watching. I ain't wanna share, so beware if you reach, you get scorched. Ever since I jumped off the porch, I knew that I would grow to be the boy. The boy then grew to be the man. Learn how to kill a